let's bring in our guest who is standing by in Detroit, Michigan, National Trial Attorney Michael Jaffer. Michael, Happy New Year. Good to see you. Uh, what do you Happy think about this witness? Uh, he's very important, but he's not very forthcoming for those of us who are analyzing this case. This is going to be the problem for the prosecution getting into uh, a racketeering investigation of any type of an organized crime organization, right? Whether it's the mafia, whether it's a street gang, whatever it is. This is difficult. You know, Julia, I felt a little bit of sadness when she was going through the cross, the, the examination of his tattoo on his neck. Uh, it just made me think that, you know, it has taken another phase. Uh, I totally respect what they're doing. I totally respect that they have complaints spanning years about this uh, uh, organization before they ever level, leveled these charges. And you can imagine, all of us as attorneys, what the conversations were like in the, pro in the closed room of the prosecution when they were debating, how are we even gonna examine them? Because this case is not about well, they had rap lyrics, and so that's evidence to level a charge. That wasn't it. That was more of like certain glue and certain components of an overarching case. But they're going to have to get into the weeds. They're going to have to ask questions about a tattoo. Why was the, the L this uh, shaped like a gun? Why was this red? And you could tell that the witness was being cagey. He's using red because of the the reds, you know, the Bloods and Crips gang. I mean, that's why he's using it, but he can't say it because, unfortunately for him, he'll probably get shot on the streets if he says something about anybody, right? And he knows that he's not going to get protection. So it's sad. So my opinion, from a legal standpoint, um, this is why we need juries. This is why this is what juries specialize in. It they're in the room with you when you're answering questions, and he was answering questions, and they're gauging his credibility, and then they have to gauge the overwhelm, the overarching relevance to the to the charges that they're going to have in the jury instructions in a few weeks. Um, this was tough. This is not like look at this video. He pointed a gun and he shot it. It's why did you have this tattoo on your neck? And then eventually we're going to hear, what did you mean by this lyric in this rap song? It's, uh, it's jarring, but it's part of the process and can't be avoided.